Historically, ERP systems have been several steps behind manufacturers that have adopted lean manufacturing. This all changed with the release of Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012. There's now an ERP system that includes functionality that not only supports lean principles and methodology, but also provides a lean strategy for the transition away from traditional manufacturing practices. This introduction provides a broad overview of some of the main characteristics of lean thinking and the functionality within Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012 that supports lean manufacturing. Lean manufacturing is a strategy for remaining competitive by identifying and eliminating wasteful steps in products and processes. And the basic goal is to get more done with less, minimize inventory at all stages of production, shorten product cycle times, and eliminate waste. Lean manufacturing evolved from the Toyota production system. After World War II, Taiichi Ono began a program of process improvement at Toyota. He determined that traditional batch and queue production, which promotes producing products in large batch quantities, was an outdated model. Improving production processes led to the transformation of Toyota's factories so that equipment is laid out based on a more logical sequence of manufacturing and assembly steps. Lean thinking adopted Ono's transformational approach the lean transformation begins by applying five principles that represent a major change in mindsets and attitudes rooted in traditional batch and queue production. Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012 for lean manufacturing is based on these five lean principles of Womack and Jones. First is customer value. Identify value and specify what creates value from the customer's perspective. Value adding activities transform the product closer to what the customer actually wants. An activity that does not add customer value is considered to be waste. Next is identify the value stream. The value stream is a sequence of process steps needed to design, produce, and deliver products to the customer. Value stream mapping is an important tool that models the lean transformation. Next is flow. Create flow wherever possible in the process. Flow manufacturing ties all the production and transfer activities together into the most efficient combinations to maximize value added content while minimizing waste. With flow, the waiting time between processes is eliminated, adding value more quickly. Next is establish pull. Pull is making only what is needed by the customer. With a pull concept, nothing is produced until the customer signals a need. And fifth is striving for perfection. Lean is a journey of continuous improvement and the goal is to economically produce exactly what the customer wants exactly when the customer wants it. Perfection is an aspiration. Anything and everything is able to be improved. Dynamics AX 2012 supports the following lean best practices. Value stream mapping, flow manufacturing, pull replenishment, Kanban quantity calculation, capable to promise, lean accounting, and mixed mode manufacturing. The starting point for lean implementations is to understand and map the value stream. All production and transfer activities of the value stream are modeled as production flows in Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012. And flow is made possible by transforming the factory based on the results of the value stream mapping process. In Dynamics AX 2012, Production flows provide the foundation of flow by organizing all the production and transfer activities in a format that supports the smooth flow of products and components through the entire value stream. Flow manufacturing works with a pull strategy. Pull is a method of material replenishment based upon usage to replace the material consumed. Kanban is a pull system that uses production and replenishment signals to respond to real customer needs and not to forecast a prediction. Kanban in Japanese, loosely translated, is card or signal. In AX 2012, Kanban is implemented as the framework to plan, track, and execute lean manufacturing. Kanban signals are for the most part transferred electronically. And this practice of transferring a Kanban as an electronic signal instead of a physical card is known as electronic Kanban. An electronic Kanban improves upon the traditional Kanban approach by also being able to respond immediately to specific demand events. Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012 supports three types of Kanbans, production, withdrawal, and purchase. Production Kanbans are used to signal the need for production. Withdrawal Kanbans are used to move a specific item between supermarkets, warehouses, and production locations. 
AX2012 purchasing processes are designed to support pull purchasing while using normal purchase orders to carry demand, delivery, and invoicing information. This approach allows the full range of purchase operations, including EDI integration, and the usage of Enterprise Portal for the vendor to view and update the purchase information. Microsoft Dynamics AX2012 supports both make-to-stock and make-to-order replenishment strategies. Fixed quantity Kanbans are provided to support make-to-stock strategies, along with event Kanbans that respond to specific demand events. Lean manufacturing is visual. In Lean Manufacturing for Dynamics AX2012, the visual planning and execution of Lean Manufacturing is done by using electronic Kanban boards. The Kanban scheduling board allows for the scheduling of production Kanbans by work cells and it can also be used as an Andon board showing a work cell's overall load and progress. The Kanban transfer board is used to transfer and receive material, components, and finished products. And the Kanban process board is used to prepare, start, and complete production in a work cell. The Kanban Transfer and Process Board support the use of barcodes to manage Kanban transactions. Microsoft Dynamics AX2012 introduces a new visual tool to schedule production Kanbans by work cell, the Kanban Scheduling Board. The board gives a visual overview of a selected number of periods and allows the scheduler to sequence jobs and control the capacity usage of the cell. Manual scheduling can be combined with automatic scheduling. Kanbans can be planned, unplanned, moved in sequence, or moved from period to period with the Kanban scheduling board. Withdrawal Kanbans are implemented on the shop floor using the Kanban transfer board. The Kanban board provides the visibility to gather materials to replenish line side locations and to support the picking of materials from supermarkets. The Kanban transfer board is designed for warehouse workers and water spiders that need to perform the following task. Replenish Kanban supermarkets, pick for Kanban transfers, receive Kanban transfers, and ship Kanbans to other sites or to subcontractors. After Kanbans are scheduled using the Kanban scheduling board, shop floor personnel use the Kanban process boards to perform required transactions against the production Kanbans. The Kanban process board in AX2012 specifically targets three shop floor user profiles. First is the shop floor supervisor. Now this role needs a complete overview of what happens in a specific work cell and also decides on priorities and sequences of jobs. The water spider, this role replenishes supermarkets on the shop floor, prepares handling units and picks material for Kanbans, puts away finished products or moves semi-finished products to the next work cell or supermarket. And third, the machine operator or shop floor worker, this role reports the start and end of jobs and the objective of the Kanban process board is to keep system interaction at a minimum while providing maximum visibility. An important company objective in the lean transformation process is improving customer delivery and responsiveness. The capable to promise functionality occurs automatically at sales order entry time or in a batch job after sales orders have been entered. The availability of resources is determined by the Kanban schedule boards, while the availability of material is determined by explosion and pegging processes similar to manufacturing with production orders. The CTP delivery date control helps companies verify that requested ship dates can be met and will also update confirmed ship dates on sales line if there's a problem fulfilling the customer's original requested ship date. Determining the required number of Kanbans is an important lean planning task. AX2012 provides the capability to calculate the Kanban quantity by taking into account historical demands, forecast, or actual demands. The Kanban quantity calculation in AX2012 is based on user-defined calculation formulas. Lean manufacturing disrupts the traditional cost concepts of job costing because the context of a production order is not available. Lean Manufacturing for AX2012 uses a production flow as the cost accumulator. Work in process is tracked for every production flow. In AX2012, costing for Lean Manufacturing uses the cost accumulation method of backflush costing. Backflush costing is used to simplify and in some cases eliminate the need for systematic and sequential reporting of resource usage for production flow. 
Under the back flush costing method, material cost for items supplied is accumulated in the production flow based on standard cost. Manufacturing costs are also absorbed at standard costs when production flow work and process is completed. Lean manufacturing can be introduced in different ways. While some companies apply the lean principles value stream by value stream, others take a more local approach and start with specific work cells. AX2012 supports mixed mode manufacturing environments where both lean manufacturing and traditional manufacturing exist. Mixed mode scheduling within AX2012 reconciles and manages planning approaches where a mixture of traditional production orders and Kanbans are used. AX2012 has provided various Kanban scenarios to help link traditional MRP push and lean pull systems. The functionality within AX2012 that supports lean manufacturing is based on the following key points. Lean manufacturing is a way of manufacturing that's based on the five lean principles. It's important in lean manufacturing implementations to understand the value stream and to map it in order to provide the proper inputs into the AX2012 system configuration. The production flow is a new concept that's a mainstay of lean manufacturing in AX2012. The work cell is modeled as a resource group and provides different mechanisms for scheduling in lean environments. Various types of Kanbans and pull replenishment strategies are used to support lean manufacturing processes. Costing for lean manufacturing in Dynamics AX 2012 is implemented through backflush costing based on a standard cost framework. And lean manufacturing in AX 2012 is highly interactive, drawing upon information from other modules. Lean manufacturing for AX 2012 is much more than a new version of lean manufacturing for AX 2009. It's a new foundation providing an open architecture to support different manufacturing techniques for different industries with different production and replenishment strategies. It allows the successful implementation of lean manufacturing for companies that are just starting the lean journey as well as for companies that already have a lean manufacturing history. And the back-end integration in scheduling and costing establishes lean manufacturing as an integrated part of ERP. To learn more about Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012 for lean manufacturers, contact Ellipse Solutions at 937-312-1547 through email at solutions at ellipsesolutions.com or visit our website at www.ellipsesolutions.com.